Target audience is 13 and up. Hey guys, welcome back for another video. Today we are taking a look at BX15 Leon Claw from Beyblade X. This is King's Beyblade, who has become probably my favorite character in Beyblade X so far, if you guys have been following the manga. Very cool character. He should show up in the anime in the next couple episodes, which is pretty exciting. And there's some pretty interesting parts on this. So we've got 560 and we've got point. Point is a, uh, a pretty interesting bit that we'll take a look at in a minute. So this is a starter, so it does come with a launcher. You've got sort of uh, some black, gold, and white there with a gold ripcord. I've heard that the teeth on this ripcord are a little bit thicker than the black ones. So keep that in mind if you guys are thinking about picking this up. So first up, we've got the blade. So a lot of people have compared this to like Leon from Metal Fight. The first thing uh, this Beyblade and the character King reminded me of was something from the White Tigers. It really reminded me of Lee as far as like King's design goes. The Beyblade itself, I could see the chip design being sort of, uh, sort of reminiscent of Leon, but um, that's about it for me. Uh, the 560 ratchet is pretty good. These five ratchets actually have pretty good burst resistance, more than I thought they would. And then we've got the bit point. So this is kind of like CS without the rubber. So very interesting bit. Um, I'm interested to test this out and see sort of what kind of applications it will have. Uh, I'm not sure about defense, maybe like hybrid attack. I'm not really sure. Sometimes they list parts as being use, useful for a certain thing and then it ends up being useful for something completely different. So one thing worth mentioning is Leon is kind of light um, in comparison to a lot of the other blades. I think it is second lightest right next to Duranzer. So we'll see if that has a major impact on some of the combo building and whether or not it's going to be viable sort of for attack or defense. Um, I, I don't think it's going to be great for stamina just because of the shape, but we will see. Surprisingly, the ratchets don't weigh a whole lot more than any of the other ratchets we got. I really expected them to be like a gram heavier or something, but really they're, they're pretty close. I'm not sure how they managed to do that, but there is not much more weight added to the five ratchets over the three or the four. Um, they're all pretty comparable. All right, so the thing that I'm most interested in part-wise, aside from the blade, is definitely point. It seems like a pretty interesting tip. It's got this sort of ball in the middle for stamina, and then it's got this outer sort of flat. Kind of reminds me of um, CS in Metal Fight, minus the rubber. So I don't know. Uh, well, I'm going to do a couple of test launches just by itself to see sort of how it performs. So flat launching in the center. Interesting. Let's do um let's do sort of a tilted launch. So it's got kind of an erratic movement pattern. Like if it's tilted at all, you'll see where it sort of like slowly goes up and then comes back down and then goes up and then comes back down. I don't know, it's pretty interesting. So uh, let's do a couple quick test battles. Let's throw it up against Wizard Arrow first and see how it does. <laughs>
All right, let's try it up against Hellsight. Okay, so stock, I don't think this is great. Um, but I think switching around some parts is gonna help it quite a bit. I think this tip is probably better suited on something else. Um, Leon's got some decent um, sort of attack potential, I think, but it's kind of light. So Throwing it on a, on a stamina tip or a hybrid stamina tip like this, I don't think is a good idea. I think this tip actually might work better on Hellsight than, um, than Leon Claw. But we will be testing this tomorrow. Um, we'll probably do some attack build combos, probably with low, flat, and flat, and just see how that does. Um, but stock, I definitely don't think Point is uh, doing Leon any favors. I just don't think it works on this movie. I don't know. I do think Point could potentially work on some other blades that have a little bit more stamina, potentially. Um, I just don't think that point on Leon Claw is going to be great. So anyway, I'm interested to know your thoughts, guys. Again, this is one of my um, one of my favorite releases so far. I've been more hyped for this than uh, pretty much anything else that's released thus far, just because King is such a cool character, um, and it, his design just really reminds me of uh, Lee from Bakuten Shoot. But um, yeah, let me know your thoughts down below. Hit the like for the algorithm, and I will see you guys in the next one. And a big shout out to our patrons, PJC92, Joseph, Zanke, Teddy, Lucario, Jotomo, Blueberry, Sammy, and Michael. Thank you for supporting the channel. Thank you everybody else for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I will see you all in the next one.